I'm Jason, the world is yours, and today we're taking a look at the Air Jordan 1 Mid Dunk Contest Sneaker Colorway. As a follow-up to the free throw line Air Jordan 3 back in 2018, Jordan Brand is once again playing, paying tribute to Michael Jordan's memorable 1988 slam dunk contest where he took flight from the free throw line with a special edition of the Air Jordan 1 Mid Dunk Contest Sneaker Colorway. That's the photo of Jordan flying through the air. This offering of the Air Jordan 1 Mid comes, um, comes constructed in a full leather build with mesh tongues and lighting, lining. Highlighting the shoe is the time of the legendary dunk 351 printed behind the tongues and lateral hair along with special graphic insoles. Check out the official photos below and look for the Air Jordan 1 um, Mid Dunk Contest sneaker colorway to release in the coming months. No specific release date. Looks like it's going to be dropping in 2023 and very unfortunately, no retail price. That's unfortunate because these sneakers are super dope. I think these are going to be pretty... Uh, no, I'm not going to even say I think. These are going to be very hard to find. I got to be very honest. These are super dope. Great color. We can't really see the soles, but you can see some kind of image. Let me just go in just a little bit. You can see Jordan on the left insole. I can't see what's happening on the right insole. I have no idea. But on the left insole, you can see Jordan flying through the air, dunking a basketball. Um, let's look at the rest of the sneaker. Nice, um, what is this, a cream color? Oh, it looks like there's some laser print on these sneakers. Do you see that on the on the uh, mid? Oh, that's interesting. Oh, look at this right here. Look, it's um, the graphic is 350. Does it say 351? It looks like 35. That's interesting. You could kind of see the laser print. Oh, look at the box that it comes in. This is a very dope. This is going to cost, I'm going to say, probably 220 and it's going to be super hard to find. Look at the box that it comes with. Very cool. It doesn't um say if it comes with different laces, but I don't really I mean, I think you could obviously you can go with the red laces. Those would be dope. Um I now I think about it, I don't think I'm going to like the black laces. I think you can go with the cream color laces. I think I would definitely go maybe with the cream color laces or maybe the red laces, right? I don't mind the black laces. It's just it doesn't really connect with the rest of the shoe in my opinion i like that that of course the nike check is black that's cool but i think if you if you threw in um maybe that cream color lace um you can kind of see the laser print here it's really difficult to see but it's kind of in there you can see some laser print on the mid of the sneaker this is a very dope sneaker like i said i think it's going to be super hard to find most likely it's going to sell out especially with the special edition box that it comes with sneaker heads love special edition boxes look at this box this box is very dope so just for that alone i think it's going to probably sell out um uh let me see the soul is black um definitely a fan of black souls i live here in las vegas so you can imagine what a white soul looks like after walking up and down the las vegas strip so i'm definitely a fan of the black soul on the sneakers but like i said if it was up to me i would change the laces to the cream color laces or maybe a um because even like right here when i look at the sneakers like Ah, uh, that's cool. You know, the black, I wouldn't lace it up all the way up there. That's This is crazy how, I mean, obviously it's just a look, but I definitely wouldn't lace it up there because you can't even see the tongues. You can see the Jordan um, brand right there, the Jordan image on the tongue. So I would definitely not lace it up all the way that far up. And I would change the laces to that that cream color lace. I really, really like the, that cream, I guess, I don't know if it's cream, maybe it's tan color laces on these sneakers. I think it would really, really make the sneaker pop even more. But unfortunately, no retail price and unfortunately, no um, release date. This is super, look at this image. You can see the image in the air, 351. Um, but yeah, that's unfortunate. But I, you know, I'm going to keep my eyes out for now. I probably won't be able to buy these because like I said, I think this is going to be like a sneakerhead type of a, um, type of a release, uh, you know, resellers type of release. I know Nike said something about um, cutting a little bit of production in 2023. So sneakers of, of these types that are very, very special edition, limited edition type sneakers are going to be even harder 
for someone like myself, general release retail person who just tries to walk into a store and just pick up a pair of sneakers. I think these are going to be super difficult to find, but unfortunately, no specific release date and unfortunately, no specific release price, um, but these should be dropping in 2023. That's an entire year. I mean, you know, as far as the date. You know, we have no idea, but it should be dropping out. You know, I don't know if it's saying that we're dropping in early 2023, uh, mid 2023 or next year at this time, but should be dropping in 2023. And like I said, I think these are going to be pretty hard to find. I like them. I would definitely buy these sneakers, but I can't uh, talk about the retail price at the moment. Um, I'm Jason. The world is yours. Today we were taking a look at a very, very dope sneaker silhouette. Um, The Air Jordan 1 mid dunk contest sneaker colorway hit the like button hit the subscribe button hit the one dollar donation button and please tune in to the next video on this channel thanks a million for watching